I'm Erin Conrad from Two Works For You. Here are today's top stories. Two more people have now died from the flu here in Oklahoma. That's according to the Oklahoma State Department of Health. 45 people have died so far this flu season. Out of those 45 deaths, 10 people are from Tulsa County. The total number of hospitalizations this flu season is 2001 here in Oklahoma. Experts say the best way to combat the flu is to get your shot and make sure you always wash your hands. And multiple families are displaced after an early morning apartment fire. The fire started at the Royal Arms Apartments near 51st and Peoria around 630 this morning. Craig Richards was inside his apartment when his daughter saw the flames and alerted his family. The family then went door to door alerting neighbors after noticing that the complex was up in flames. Fire crews tell us seven units are not safe for living. No one was hurt. The fire marshal is now investigating that cause. And the teenager accused of making threats to shoot up a McAllister High School is expected back in court today. Alexis Wilson was arrested back in September after deputies found an AK-47, a shotgun, and several rounds of ammo in her bedroom. Court documents say at least seven people are expected to testify this afternoon at the Pittsburgh County Courthouse. And let's get a check of the forecast with meteorologist Brandon Woolley. Good afternoon, Aaron, and good afternoon, everyone. Well into the 50s for this afternoon, coming in at 56, thanks in part to that southwesterly breeze, upwards of 20 miles per hour, increasing clouds with maybe a few widely scattered rain showers across the region by this evening. By early tomorrow morning, not as cold, 33 degrees. This morning, we are down into the teens and 20s. Your latest 10-day forecast, tomorrow afternoon, 63, low to the mid-70s. This weekend, chance for rain showers by Monday throwing in some thunderstorms on Tuesday, wrapping up those rain showers by early Wednesday morning. Aaron. All right, thank you, Brandon. That was a look at our digital update. Keep checking back for updates all throughout the day. I'm Erin Conrad. Two works for you.